just want to give you a revelation that will help all of us today. Peace from God. It's only peace from God or from our Lord Jesus Christ that can make us to be Christians without complaints. A revelation of life is when Christ enters your life. A revelation about what is life around you, life in your life, is when Christ enters your life. I want to tell you that it's only the peace from God that will make you not to worry about what is around you. When salvation enters your life, peace will come. And when peace comes, this is the peace that does not have any connection with anything outside of your body. The peace in you, not peace outside. There are many people that when you look them outside, you desire them, but inside there is nothing. There is no peace. I began to say that many of us, we want peace outside. We are making, we think that all these things around us will bring peace to our lives, and there's no peace. We normally think that if I get money, I will have peace. If I build this house, I will have peace. But the peace that comes by salvation is the peace that will enter you to extend that even the things outside you will never bother you. John 14, verse 26 to 31. You can still move forward when it's tough. Why? Because there is peace in you. That verse 27, again, it says, Peace, I live with you. Jesus left us with peace. And he says, do not let your heart be troubled. Why? Because you are going to meet something. I don't know what you are going through now. But do not let, in other words, listen, you have got ability to restrain your heart. Not to worry or to be troubled. Though you can't see Jesus here, don't worry. He says, I'm going away from you. What you need you don't need to see things. You just need that peace in you. I don't know if you're hearing that. We normally want to see visions. We want to see Jesus visiting you. Don't worry about seeing Jesus. Because what matters is what is in you than what is outside. We, we are trying to attract people by what is outside. That's why people are being deceived today. You have been looking outside than inside. You have been robbed by seeing things outside and the people who have those things, they don't even sleep. Many success you see, they didn't come right away, on a right way. But the success that is from God won't start from outside. It will start from inside. Jesus here was telling disciples that, you know, you will face trouble, but don't think about it. You will feel opposition, but don't think about it. Holy Spirit has brought joy because there is peace in you. Whatever you are facing, it's a plus. It's just to tell you that you have to maintain your peace. John 16, verse 33. Understand that when you're a child of God, you must be challenged. But any challenge that is coming your way is looking for the peace you have received from the Holy Spirit. You must never lose that peace. Amen. There is no one in the world who is better or safer from temptations. No one is safer from temptations. If God wants to promote you, tribulation must come. But listen to this. For you to reach to the destiny of the blessing is how you maintain that peace. Ask your neighbor, are you having peace? Because some of you, you still have grudges. You are still, you are offended. There are still a lot of things happening around you. And all your focus is what has happened to you. James 1 verse 3. Your level of, your level in the spirit is shown by peace. How you maintain your peace. God will never lift anybody who does not have peace.
Yes, Nankucho. If you don't have peace in you, you are not matured. If you're not mature, there are things that God will never give you. Because you're not fit for them. You just need to hear from God and remain calm. God will direct you and give you that peace. And that peace will shock everyone. When this peace enters you, you will forget about money. You will forget about your debts. You will forget about what devil is doing. Satan wants to occupy your mind and you fail to sleep. They want to occupy you and affect your heart, affect your mind and give you depression. Just enjoy yourself in the Lord. Enjoy yourself in the Lord. The joy of the Lord will be your strength and the peace will sustain you. I believe there are people who are listening to me here. You need peace of God and the peace of God will make you to prevail on what you are going through. James 3, Jacob 3, from verse 18. Verse 18. Maybe we can read from 13, it's fine. Peace that we have. Peace that we have. Peace that we have. Peace that we have. That makes us to be spiritual mature. Makes us to be able to, to sow it to others. We are able to sow it to other people. We are able to encourage each other in peace. Without peace, we cannot give out peace. What will happen? It will be jealousy. Selfish ambition. Disorder. Peace is checked on the individuals. Between the individuals. Check how you live with people. Check how you live with friends and enemies. If truly you have peace, purity will be your life. Philippians 4, 6-7. Philippians 4. 6 to 7. Verse 6 to 7. Colossians 3 verse 15. Makolosa 3 15. When peace is not a factor. How could you is in Colossians 3 verse 15. Makolosa 3 15. If it's not a controlling factor. I see your nanto elaulang. In your heart. Belong chalina. Doubt will rise. Obilaila we are pahama. From there, revelations will go. Utuamoku to Lodia cham. If peace leave you, you become blind. Actually, you become blind. If you want to see revelations, allow peace to reign in you. Matthew 5, Matthew 5 verse, 9, verse 9, you cannot show the character of God without peace. I don't know what is disturbing you today. Blessed that you will be called a son of God. Blessed that when people look at you, they see a character of God because of peace in you. Peace in you reveals God how he is. Someone doesn't want to speak with you, but you are speaking with the person. Okay. You are able to greet the person. I know, I know, especially we Christians. Especially people who are called. When Satan wants to limit you, he allows people to hurt you so that you cut them off. From there, God cannot show you visions about them. You become limited to his character when you lose peace. You become limited to your destiny when you lose peace. What God wants to reveal about you is when you have peace that your spirit